1993, when snowy plovers were listed, uh, there were about 30 birds uh, left in Oregon. Now there's somewhere between four and 500. Snowy plovers need to see all the way around them uh, to detect predators coming towards their, their nesting location. They cannot nest in dense vegetation because uh, they're such a small bird. They just can't navigate through the vegetation hides predators that may prey on their eggs or small chicks. They prefer open, open sand beach environments. The Sayislav National Forest applied for a grant from the Washington office to fund a project that would connect the habitat from Siltkus Estuary all the way down to our dunes day use area, nesting habitats. We were given $200,000 for that project and um, we really didn't know how far that would take us, but we were able to complete a little over 20 acres this winter. So in front of us is a regraded area of Fordune and uh, prior to this winter, it was completely a stand of thick beach grass where plovers could not nest. And we scraped off the beach grass and uh, reshaped the four dune so to make habitat for western snowy plovers. And right now we have uh, several pairs nesting in this area where prior to this winter, we did not have nesting in this area which is fantastic. <laughs> we are so grateful for that funding and um, we did receive more funding this spring to do more work this winter and it's uh, our hope that we will be able to complete the entire stretch which will encompass about 50 to 55 or so acres in total when it's complete.